There are just a few things that you need to remember when making compost. Composting is a natural process involving many different kinds of bugs. You have to provide the right ingredients to feed the bugs and give them the conditions they like to live in. They need food, air and a bit of moisture. The material you put into your compost bin can be divided into greens and browns. Basically, you need a mixture of both. The greens are the young, tender and moist materials such as grass clippings, vegetable peelings from the kitchen and other tender plant material from the garden. The greens tend to rot very quickly. If you leave a heap of grass mowings alone for a few days, it will soon get hot. This shows that the compost bugs have started to work. But grass on its own will rot down to a slimy heap that isn't compost. The greens are important because this is the food that the bugs really like to eat. This is the stuff that really gets the heat going. The browns are the tougher materials, like these woody prunings or dry stuff, like this plant debris that has been cleared from the garden or autumn leaves. This stuff takes ages for the bugs to break down. The browns are important because they have structure and body to the heap. This will ensure that there is always plenty of air within the material. Remember that the composting bugs need air to do their job. Straw, wood shavings, cardboard and paper are also browns but don't forget to crumple the paper before you put it in. Many items that you can add to the compost heap are a mixture of both greens and browns. For example, these soft prunings where the leaves are still young and sappy, but they also have a more woody stem. So, the key to making really good compost is to add a balanced mixture of greens, And browns. The greens will get the composting bugs started and the browns will give structure and body to the heap. If the material you add to the bin is dry then you will also need to add a bit of water. The final ingredient is the many microorganisms that will do the composting for you. You can't see them but there are millions in this handful of compost. They move in on their own accord so luckily you don't have to add them. <laughs>